¿Qué onda, Miguel? ¿Ves cómo están? Regresamos a un capítulo más de un tildón. Este es el onceavo capítulo ya. Eh, creo que yo creo que ya casi cerca del final. Eh, el capítulo entero estuvo muy intenso, muy revelador con lo que pasó. Descubrimos que, entre comillas, el asesino es Josh. Pero en realidad todo lo que él hizo fue una broma. Entonces, ¿qué pasó con Jess? ¿Qué le está pasando a Emi Amad? ¿Quién es el de lanzallamas en la mina? ¿Qué es esa criatura que se alcanza a ver? Muchas preguntas todavía por resolver, señores. Entonces, sin más preámbulos, nos quedamos exactamente con Em, en donde eh, se encontró con el de lanzallamas y le dio al parecer lo que eran bengalas eh, para poder, este, supongo que seguir caminando en lo que es en, la, en las minas. Entonces, prácticamente vamos a partir de ahí. Vamos a ver qué podemos hacer. La música no me da nada de confianza. Ok, ya se calmó la música, eso es bueno. No sé exactamente a dónde tenemos que ir. ¡Oh, Dios! ¿Qué fue eso? ¿Qué hay algo? Trae un hueco, ok. Espero. ¡Oh, shit! ¿Qué carajos es eso? Eso no era una... Man, brazo, ¡ay ¡Oh, Dios! Ese no es un brazo de persona, ¿qué se hizo? Ok, bien, bien, bien Es un monstruo, lo sabía ¿Qué onda con eso? ¿Ese es Lenderman? ¿Tu Boogeyman? A la izquierda, a la derecha ¡Ay, ¡Oh, hijo de la! Joder Creo que era a la izquierda, está el elevador, no había visto Rápido, 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 rápido. Joder. <risa> Yo creo que la criatura alcanzó a matar al de lanzallamas o lo esquivó, no sé. ¿Qué onda con eso? Oh shit. Oh oh. Oh oh. Atrás, atrás de ti. Atrás de ti No me muevo, no me muevo, no me muevo, no me muevo Se lo oscuro Ni siquiera voy a respirar Ok uh. Ah, entonces esta es la criatura que se veía que persiguió a Hanna y a Beth al principio del juego y el de lanzallamas estaba peleando con él. ¿Qué onda? ¿Pero qué es eso? Hmm. Tengo una teoría, los de las. Los, los de la. los que trabajan en la mina cavaron más de lo debido y creo que encontraron algo en las profundidades. Oh Dios, llegamos a un callejón de salida. Síguele, no pares. Te dije. ¡Ah! La cansa a morder. ¿Qué es eso? ¡Wow! ¡Shin! Santo madrazo que se dio. Le pregunta todo esto, ¿es dónde carajos está más? Wow. Se puso muy intenso. ¿Qué es esa criatura? Okay. Y por aquí, ¿quién está corriendo? ¿Em todavía? Sí, es Em ¿eh? 
Oh, Em llegó a la cabaña. Exactly what happened. I am trying to tell you. We were climbing up the tower and it it fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What mines? There are these mine shafts all over running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell? How'd it fall? There's something else. I found this little like it was almost like a camp and this little broken wooden cross and it, it had it had Beth's name on it. I think they fell down there, and, and I think Beth died from the fall. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God, poor Beth. Listen, in in the tower, there was there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, Mike. Barely. What about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I... She's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. Fucking that be? Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Hey, you're the corner. Probablemente se vea Matt, ¿no? ¿Quién más? O el de lanzallamas? Ya par de nenas Abran Oh shit Es el de lanzallamas Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. Ah, it's a Wendigo. What are you talking about? The hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Hmm. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I want to get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Cállate, déjalo hablar. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh crap. Cannibalism? Somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Ah, uh, your friend will already be dead. No, no, he can't be. We, we were just with him. 
A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then, I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. You going alone is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. Don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Hmm. Get ill. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Hmm. Uh, yeah. Mariquita? So hmm. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. This is the end you point towards the thing you want to kill. Hmm. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. Hmm. What? How do you know? Trust me, I know. Okay. Hey. Come back safe. Vaya. We need to hurry, son. I, uh, see you soon. So, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. What's uh, what, what's a guy got to know? Que es inmortal. You just be careful. Hmm. You follow my lead. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you've been shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them. If you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. Okay. Hmm. Well, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable? Or... I mean, can you figure out what they're going to do? some patterns like any animal or human what, you mean like how like they've got schedules well they only hunt at night oh why i didn't ask the uh pro wendigo tips like if i rub garlic all over me they won't be able to smell me or something oh, they'll still smell you anything like that I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. Entonces, básicamente, como el T-Rex, ¿no? El T-Rex se supone que si no te ve, bueno. Tan tan. If these things, Wendigos, are or, or were human, do they, they still have some aspect of humanity in them? Well, they retain certain things. I mean, is it really right to kill them? Maybe they could be cured or... or... <laughs> they surrender human rights the moment they eat one another. There's no cure, there's no redemption. I, I, I mean, if they're still human, I don't know if it's right to hurt them. Ok, hay sangre aquí en el camino, no había dado cuenta. Oh. Mad, amiguito. Estás bien. Ya no está. Ya vámonos. Piece by piece. Again, he 
keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs one piece at a time. So who wants that? Hmm. Yeah. Let's go now. It might still be near. A ver, esperen, no hay nadie. Creo que no hay nada. Aquí hay otra cosa. No, no hay nada. Ok, vamos. Oh Dios, ahí viene, ahí viene, ahí viene. Wow. De un tajo. Toma. A correr, a correr, a correr, a correr, a correr, a correr, corre, 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 Chris, corre. Toma. Buenísima. Ay, imbécil. Oh, shit, ahí está. No puede ser. No. No. Oh. No, Chris. Joder, por no decidirme. Carajo. Joder. <risa> Dios, me siento culpable por no decidirme. Josh, 
some shit out of luck. Hmm. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. M. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key, right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what Keep is all that? So, uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? You've been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. God. Some of them survived, but like 15 of them didn't make it. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody being tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how to get the fuck out of here. Pero quién es el que estaba con los perros? Josh o el viejo este? El de lanza llamas, eso es lo que tal no me cuadra. What? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's, it's not that. Se va a convertir en uno. M, if that thing bit. I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes, Emily. At least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens if it bit you, you're gonna turn into one, and then you're gonna turn on us. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Calmate, loca, no las tenica. Be down here with us. What, Mike? You gotta go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell, I am. Emily, you can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. What is this, guys? What are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mike, calm down. You're... you're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. Ah, recuerdo no, el balazo en la cara. Don't, don't do that. I'm really sorry. Ok, no quiero más muertes, estoy, tengo, estoy con la conciencia intranquila de haber dejado morir a Chris. Y ahora, ¿y Matt? ¿Y Josh? ¿Y el psicólogo? ¿Y ahora qué? I thought that that he was gonna help us with the flamethrower, dude. Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've got to be tough. We've got to do this on our own. I don't know if I can. This guy's a little OCD. There's 
a lot of history to this. Claro, digo, y tú sigues leyendo como metiche. This says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. Ya, ah, ya se va a empezar a llenar de ideas esta loquita. that the bites it, if it bites you it's not infectious it doesn't do anything let me see uh, that I'm sorry what did you say um it says she'll be okay it says what you're gonna be fine fine Michael almost shot me is that he fine didn't shoot you. and this bitch almost let him hey, that's <laughs> fair. She was scared. I'm the one who's scared I'm Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm no excuse. There's no excuse. I'm like, please just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. Jean. I'm sorry. I'm so 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 sorry. Shit. Shit shit shit. We've gotta get the mic. Like now. Okay. Y el arma. Mínimo se habían llevado el arma. Oh, Joshua. Okay. Okay, ¿qué onda? I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger hmm. to help someone else. Remember last year? Huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Just que tuvo que ver. has gone terribly wrong and your friends like your sisters have deserted you you're all alone okay en todo el tiempo yo fue que estaba en el psicólogo why did you hurt them joshua why did you hurt them They didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. Hmm. They made a stupid mistake and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. They did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry at least until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture. Hmm. Let's hope that it's not too late for atonement. And that your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you from something even worse than death itself. Okay. Entonces yo está vivo. Los productos de su imaginación. Dios, esto por no decidirme si dispararle al buen hijo o a la gasolina murió. Ah. I'm so sorry, Ashley. What about the old guy? No sign of him. Wait. No more. Debería seguir disparando al buen amigo mejor. So. What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. 
And what is all that? It may have taken him down to the mine. <laughs> um, what is that? Huh? This is the safe room, M. <laughs> Please. Fuck, I can't do this. Oh, you did the right thing. Yo creo que en todos los totales nos muestra lo que no debemos de hacer porque recuerda que vimos un balazo le perforaba el ojo a M y no lo hicimos, tal vez es eso. Y bueno, capítulo 9, desesperación. Dos horas para el amanecer. Y estamos de vuelta con Mike. Ya le llegó el manicomio. Y hasta aquí señores, vamos a dejar como onceavo capítulo. Se está poniendo muy muy bueno eh, ahora ya vimos quién era el de lanzallamas una persona que estuvo ahí que sabe la leyenda y el monstruo si sí es un monstruo lo que veníamos manejando y es un buen digo no uno que supuestamente la leyenda eh, aquí nos cuentan de que bueno cuando una persona comete en canibalismo convocan a la, a la criatura y quiero creer que entonces a lo mejor fueron las personas que quedan atrapadas en las minas como bueno, quedaron atrapadas y no había modo de algún modo de alimentarse o qué sé yo, quiero suponer que entre ellas se comieron y como estaban en territorio indio, como habíamos visto antes, convocaron a la criatura y ahí empezó, se empezó todo a desatar y pues bueno, vamos a dejar aquí, en serio creo que estamos muy muy cerca del final, ya faltan dos horas para el amanecer, yo creo que ya el amanecer ya se acabó todo señores, entonces espero que les haya gustado, si fue así, regalen un like y si es la primera vez que visitan el canal y les gusta el contenido, no duden en suscribirse, nos estaremos viendo en las próximas, cuídense mucho, nos veremos después. Adiós. Ah,